Well, you were once the boss to plague me oh so very much because I never figured out how to fight you. Let's see if grinding you eight times taught me a bloody thing. Come on, you. That's the one. And a cheap hit, and wow, that doesn't do that much damage. Maybe I should have buffed my weapon instead of coming in here without any bloody advantage. Oh well, it is new game plus ten after all. It's going to have a lot more health than anticipated. Oh, bloody hell. It isn't often you pull that one out, but every time you did, I still got hit by it, and today, that rule stands true. Will you give it a bloody break? And by it, I do not mean my spine, face, or neck, even though my spine is my neck, but whatever. Oh, for God, will you? Pack it in evading. Oh my goodness. You're like the bloody lost sinner all of a sudden. Every time I go for a hit, you just stand back and evade everything, make me look stupid, and then slap me in the face. I'm not usually this bad. It's ridiculous how much health you have. Do you know that? I mean, it's as if you got as much health as you did in the last game, Ornstein. Or Ornstein, however you choose to say that. Uh oh Oh, for crying out loud. Uh oh, got greedy. That was- whoa. Got away with it. Got greedy and got smart at the same time. It's not often that bloody happens for me. That was- you cheeky bint. And every time you evade that, I know I've said it before, but you do remind me of the Lost Sinner, and all that does is remind me I'm gonna have to fight that bitch with this bloody ladle. As if it weren't bad enough, her reactions and combo manoeuvres seem to actually get better every single goddamn time. I'm gonna have to grind through all of those just to get to be able to fight her with a ladle. That is gonna be painful. Will you- will you pack it in? It's as if now I've acknowledged the fact you keep evading stuff, you're doing it more often. I can't believe I had so much trouble with you the f- God damn it, the first time I did this. I mean, granted, I'm not exactly getting through a brisk walk through the picnic park on this one, but it's a hell of a lot easier considering the fact I have the most worthless weapon in the entire game. A broken straight sword is more effective than this. When something that has the word broken in the title is more efficient than something that doesn't, don't really think you're throwing yourself in at the deep end for challenge. Alright then, your reaction time is getting a little bit slow, you're just letting me hack away at your knees. What the hell, do you want to be Rey Mysterio by the end of this fight? You're gonna want your knees for the rest of your life, fella. And I'm out of Estus flasks. This never happened when I was grinding you. Great. Well then again, that being said, remember, I was using a sword that had damage as opposed to this whittling away little thing. By the way, just to let you know, my good man, I was really disappointed when I got to New Game Plus 10. You didn't have Smau around, just sitting here. At least as a decoration. I would have liked to have actually fought you both again. J damn it. It's bad enough my weapon does a ridiculously low amount of damage, but when you do that thrust, you take reduced damage. Look, 25, 23. That's bloody stupid. How can you- Oh my god. Really? Alright, that's my fault. Wow, I just completely lost focus there. I don't even know what the fuck I was trying to attempt to do there. I was just out in the open. Whatever. Whatever. R Mulligan. Right then, I have more of a fighting chance. I have lightning for you, Mr. Dragon Slayer. You should appreciate that. You used to use lightning. And for whatever reason, you converted to the dark. Can't really say I appreciate that. I liked your lightning attacks. F what the? Oh, all right then. I mentioned the fact you converted to the dark, and your first bloody full attack, barring your introduction, is using a hex dark attack projectile at me, which you oh so very rarely use. I swear to the Lord. Connect is intercepting my words and he's just throwing the information at the game to do stuff. I can't really say I'm too against that. It's kind of cool. It's just not an advertised feature. All right now, just work with me. I had you on like half health before, then I got clumsy and died. So completely ignore that, please. Just wipe your memory of it. I mean, if the lore of this universe holds true, then this is a different strand of time and you don't even know that I died. Oh, for <sighs> that is really embarrassing. I didn't expect to die once to this fella, never mind twice. Damn it, I thought he improved. I'm just gonna blame the fact that he started off the fight with a hex. Let's just say that threw me off. Let's just say that was a bad luck charm. Ladle, 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 I made you out of clay. Simply because it's absolutely fucking worthless all through the lip long day. Thank you for that. How does that ever hit me? I don't know what your elemental weakness actually is. It sure as hell isn't dark, it doesn't seem to be lightning. It'd be fire. I really should have actually researched that before getting into this, so I could have a little bit more of an advantage. Seeing as the entire point of this is to put myself at a disadvantage, it would be nice to close the gap by a couple of inches on the several fucking miles I have decapped myself. Handicapped, by the way. Not decapped. I have no idea what that word is. No, whoa, whoa, right then. No, stop, please, I'm begging you. Thank you. You met the request of stopping, oh so very simply. How about you make the request of dying a little bit sooner? I'd rather not have to stay here for ten minutes whittling away at your bloody knees. Oh, come on, I missed. Now he's just standing up against the pillar. What the hell? You used to have a comatose state there, fellas, not like you. Your reactions are usually lightning fast. Get it? 
because you were once using lightning. Well, back down to a simple 113. I really should have repaired my weapon. I could have got a little bit more damage out of this for the early part. But I'd rather tough it out like an idiot, apparently. There you go, you're doing more jumping attacks. That's exactly what I wanted. I didn't want to miss the first attack and just waste the stamina, time, and effort, but it happened. Oh god! No, 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 no. Stop getting careless. Um, I pressed X to heal and you're not healing. Alright then, I'm so accustomed to having so much range that I keep attacking from a further distance than it's actually going to hit him with. Oh god! And the more I do that, the more damage I end up not getting on him. Thus, the more time this is going to take. As the old woman for the Asda- Oh, damn it! I was about to say, as the old woman for the Asda commercials used to say, every little helps. Th what the- Ah, oh, you're getting on my nerves with this evasion stuff. You do it so infrequently on the nine fights up to here, including the ones I failed on, and yet- here you stand, doing it oh so very frequently just to piss me off because people aren't going to see this! I get the feeling I could have just walked to the side and stra- damn it. Strafed away from that second lunge of the spear. I'm going to try that next time. Do something. Oh my lord. I get the feeling I could just walk to the side and strafe away from that one instead of using another roll. Yeah man, that's the one. No, you got greedy again. Stop doing that. We went from using no Estus flasks for a good four minutes maybe? To then using three in a second. Hey, I can walk to the right of that one. I didn't take advantage of it by actually getting some extra hits in, but it's good to know I was right. For fuck's sake with the evasion. I hate that four-hit combo. I hate it. I truly do. If I were just a couple of feet closer to you, I'd have had to have rolled for every single one just to have played it safe and made sure I did not get hit by any of that. There you go. Keep doing the lunges and the thrusts. It's so much better, man. I don't appreciate the back steps and the pivots and the swirls, but whatever. Oh, I'm getting tired of you, Ornstein. I am. The fact I had to fight you like seven or six times last night to get you up to this level only to spend a ugh, even more time on one fight than I did ever nine. Why do I keep saying nine? But it's all worth it in the end because I can say I beat you on New Game Plus 10. For fuck's sake, I keep walking into that like a bloody cretin. The longer these fights last, the more focus I lose and thus the more damage I take. I was going to be patient with you. I was going to focus. That's it. Good man. Do more of that and I can get more hits on you and you'll die quicker. Then we'll all be free from the torment of this bloody monotony. Which is not to be confused with monogamy. Though I would say one can define the other for certain people. Come on, Ornstein. Let me release you from this pain. You can go join the afterlife with Smaug. And you can even probably re-encounter your wonderful princess, which you suppose- Wow, I just stood there. Supposedly escorted all the way over here. That was probably the most effortless evasion ever. Reminds me of fighting the Pursuer all over again. I think I can just walk to the side of you to evade that. I don't think I need to roll at all. This isn't one of those instances where I'd love to test it, seeing as this is the real deal and I have to spend- Oh, fuck me. I got greedy, but got away with it. Do all those instances, but I'd rather not put myself in the situation where I have to actually get out of it. Alright, come on, you beautiful man. I do love you, really. I love your design, I love your fighting stance, I love everything about you. It's so infuriating I have had to kill you a total of 11 times after this. This being the 11th, and only- oh god, no 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 I was about to say, only about seven of them have been without summoning friends slash help. Come on, dude. All I need you to do is drop dead. I'll forget- with the evasion! You need to stop doing that for me, man! I, I, I've asked kindly, at least a dozen times, and you- and you refuse to meet the request! Thank you! You didn't do it for once. Come on, seriously. Dog on a leash. Get away from the wall. I need you to actually be in the open so I can circle you effectively and not end up brisking my ass against the brick wall. That's it. Just keep doing that. So now you're going to take reduced damage for these hits, which is fucking infuriating. Not as infuriating as that, considering the fact that was damage I definitely shouldn't have taken. I still have Radiant Life Gems, but for whatever reason I have an aversion to actually using them. Oh, for crying out loud, man. Are you trying to drag this out even longer for me? I think it goes without saying that I do not appreciate that shit. Beautiful. I get to kill you with the reduced damage. Damage! Fantastic! Would you like to know how long that took me? 22 minutes! I know I failed a couple of times, but good god, I think the actual final fight itself lasted about 10 or 12. It took me 20 minutes to beat two bosses before, and it's taken me 20 to beat one. Sweet Mary Magdalene. Oh yeah, I was a bad guy and kind of killed Targaryen at some point. Sorry about that. Considering the fact I'm part of his covenant, that's a little bit insulting. And there you have it. There's still only one flame lit because unfortunately Ornstein isn't considered a worthwhile fight despite the fact that he is a physical, literal reincarnation from the original game. I hope you look forward to the next fight, which is unfortunately for me, most likely, a certain Scorpion-S. <laughs>
And that's the end of the video. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this, then don't forget to leave a like to broadcast the fact that you'd like to see more from this specific series. And if you enjoyed it to the point where you'd actually want to see more from this series, or this channel in general, then don't forget to share this video with your friends and subscribe so you don't miss out on any future installments. And should the sub boxes be failing you, as they do for most, then feel free to bookmark my video page and check back daily, as that's how often I provide content to you. Or alternatively, you you could follow me on any respective social media service you should desire as I update them all regularly with my videos as this site isn't actually known to be good at doing its job. So as always, your viewership and YouTube support will always be infinitely appreciated. And assuming you do indeed want to see more from me and the content I provide, then I will see you in the next video.